What is up guys, Chris here, Bear Market Mining. Thanks again for stopping by. So today I'm gonna to show you a really quick and easy way to make some passive income off those GPUs and CPUs in the workstation or gaming PC you're looking at right now. So with this particular program, we can schedule it so it runs overnight while you're offline and we'll be making you some easy passive income. Let's get into it. So today we're talking about a program called salad.ai. So it's an AI usage program that's going to make good use of those resources while you're offline. Very basically, all it's going to do is allocate your GPU, CPU, or a slight amount of bandwidth towards AI programs being rented by people around the world. It's really, really easy to set up and it's making some good profits, particularly if you have a higher end GPU. So today I'm gonna to run through the exact setup and go through it so it's quick and easy. It won't take any more than 10 minutes. So I'll leave links down below. We're gonna to go to salad.com. You can have a read through of everything that's going on in here in your own time. You don't need me to read that for you. You need me to tell you how to do it. So we're gonna click on earn with PC and you're gonna click log in and make an account. So once you've made that account, it will take you over to this next page here. Now, ignore everything we've got going on here numbers wise. We'll talk about that a little bit at the end. First thing you're gonna do is click this download button, download the app. So once it's downloaded, you'll see it right here. You'll just have to click the executable file and run straight through it. Very easy to set up. As you can see, we're pretty much done. It's gonna work its way through now installing salad let's finish and run salad itself so the app itself is loading up now that's all you need to do to get it installed once you've made an account it'll ask you to log in again and we'll take you back to this main page that we're on or we're on right before it's got a list of these different rewards but we will like i said go through those later so we just have to wait a minute and it will connect to the kitchen as you see we're already set up so we we'll click set up pc now it's gonna tell you what we've got inside here right now. On this recording PC, we've got a 3080 and we've got 32 gigabytes of RAM. So if you had a 3090 or a 4090 or something with say 24 gigabytes of VRAM, these numbers double again. So this is looking at about 11 cents to six cents depending on the job USD per hour you can make. Now that of course is before electricity. So you'll have to add your electricity costs in there. So let's click continue. I like to let Salad automatically select the best performing workloads. You can configure your own workload if you need to. Um, there are a couple of things in here. It does say adult content. Now that's using some of the bandwidth. I've got no idea specifically which type of adult content that's being used, but you can turn that on or off if you like. Me personally, I don't care what people do. Leave it on, a little bit of extra money. So we'll let it automatically configure and it's gonna ask you to select a target reward. So this is where you've got a few different options. So we see some stuff right here. Look, we've got Discord stuff, Kiwi Clicker, Nitro Basic, but what are we interested in? The prepaid MasterCard, $5 is the minimum target, or the PayPal balance. So I've already selected this, but we'll select it again to click Confirm, and then open straight back up to Salad and click Finish Setup. Now down here, Chopping Power. See, we're four out of five at the moment. So to get the full Star Chef chopping power, which is gonna give you a little bit more profitability, you need to chop for over 50 hours a week. So your first couple of days, you're not going to be at full rewards. You need to enable all the resources, which it does automatically. It sets up the day environment automatically. It's got sufficient storage and we're chopping using in-demand hardware. So the 3080 right now is in-demand with 32 gigabytes of RAM as well. So we're set up for success so far. So we could just start chopping, but I wanna go through a few more things for you. If we click on performance, we can see right now, my GPU is being utilized. That's 40% for the recording. But when it clicks up to 100%, that's when you'll be mining and it will shut off other resources. So 
In here in the workload preferences, I would recommend enabling your CPU and GPU. It uses very little CPU resources, but 100% of the GPU. So that's why it's good to use while you're not working on it. And I'll show you how to set up that schedule for that later. We want to change our maximum storage use. This is for the containers when it downloads jobs up to 500 gigabytes. It's going to give you the most profitable jobs that way, along with allowing elevated permissions. Click on that. There are some more advanced options down here as well. Now let's go into them and this is the scheduling. So this is where it can work really good for you. Make this a little bit bigger on your screen. Right there. So we see down here paused is blank. No mining is grayed out and auto start is in green. So for instance, if you worked a nine to five on your desktop PC, you could just click all of these out completely or you could just gray them out like this. Okay, so that way salad's not going to run while you're working on the PC, but as soon as it goes over that time threshold, it will start chopping straight away. There's also the auto stop or auto start sections, crypto mining enabled. That's going to be a bandwidth thing again as well. Give you a little bit of extra profits, but that's really all we need to set up right here. Now we'll click chop now so you can get an idea. We'll see salad is looking for a job compatible with your hardware now you can't see it up on the screen but just up here a message popped up saying basically your gpu is in use so it will wait till that finishes before it stops chopping but that's all we need to do and we're away and mining now if you want to get an idea of how much you could be making off this while you're offline on your main salad.com summary page you would click on earn up the top the salad network monitor now this is showing you the in-demand hardware right now. So you can see some of the prices, even the 2070s older hardware are making a tiny bit of money. But if we look at the 3080, nearly eight cents an hour, you gotta pay electricity on that. So, you know, maybe a little bit more. You've got the higher end stuff, you know, the 4080, 10 cents an hour. And I think there was a 49er in here, 4090, sorry, making 16 cents. So. You can see also it's telling you how much RAM it needs and how much storage. So if you want, you could go and check these specs before you decide to get into this. But that's all there really is to it. We're up and away in mining. We've got in-demand hardware and you're utilizing your GPU and a bit of your CPU for a little bit of extra profit. That is going to wrap it up, guys. Wanted to make it really quick and easy for you. I'll leave links down below. Let me know if you've used Salad before or if you know your earning more than you're earning for instance paying more electricity than you're actually earning personally i have solar so this works great for me but if you had an office pc nudge nudge this might be a really good way to make some extra passive income leave me some comments down in the chat guys let me know what you think and i'll catch it in the next one Peace.